Hi, you guys. Welcome back to another reading. Happy Tuesday, by the way. I forgot to say happy Monday yesterday. I cannot believe that. But anyway, I'm going to be using the Kipper cards today. I'm just going to be asking um, about, I'm going to just ask about the current energy right now. So yeah, let's just see what comes out. Um, what's the current energy for the collective, for whoever clicks on? What's the current energy for the collective? Thank you. So we got journey coming out and we got concern showing up too. The number 33 could be significant, even like 10, 10. If you've been seeing 10, 10, this could be your reading or your message. Um, but with journey coming out, for some people, you could be concerned about a situation. It's like something could be not quite sitting right with you. I just got finished doing a, um, a general reading, y'all. So definitely check out. You should see that one first before you see that one. So look at the video right underneath this one. But something's not quite sitting right with you. It's like you could be kind of concerned about a, your current situation, right? Or it could be like your current environment. And it looks like with the journey coming out, I feel like you're being guided to like go into a new direction to start a new journey. That's what it looks like. But I am seeing it to where there is some type of concern or worry about starting a new journey could even to be like traveling from what's coming out so let's see um i was trying to pull one card but i'm gonna get another one for y'all what's the current energy for the collective what's the current energy for the collective what's the current energy for the collective please thank you oh concern is actually coming out here again at the bottom we got community showing up. Something looks kind of off when it comes towards a community. The number three could be significant. Like a group of three people could be significant. I don't know what that's about, but just take it how it resonates because right now I don't know exactly what it could be. But I feel like three people is significant. Something look, Something's very off. But let me see what else comes out. And it could be um, friendships too. Like for some people, there could be some type of concern. It's almost like something ain't right about a community or something of that sort. Let me see what else comes out. Tell me about Journey. Why did Journey show up as their current energy? Why did Journey show up as the collective's current energy? Thank you. Please do not fall down there. Okay. So we got the Seven of Cups coming out. We got the Two of Pentacles at the bottom. For some people, you could be in a situation, right? And it could be like a community or a group of people. I don't really know how to put it, but it's a group of people, right? They could be not grounded. It's almost like somebody needs to get grounded. And I feel like when it comes towards you making a decision or um, basically if you got several options in front of you, right? It's like you're going to choose the more um, balanced option like something that could be bringing in balance or something that help you stay grounded from what's coming out now this could be a job situation or this could be um i could i guess you can just relate it to the type of relationships that you have in your life right now that's what it looks like let me see what else comes out tell me about journey here why is journey showing up oh and you know what i just got though somebody could be getting a new car somebody could be getting a new car that just hit me like randomly because with the concern now if you are currently concerned about your vehicle now i'm not making no promises y'all this is what i see in the cars okay if you are concerned about a vehicle or like some form of transportation, right? It look like somebody gonna be picking out a new car. But it's like you, cause you know, like when you go pick out a new car or whatever, are you shopping for a new car? Of course, it's like you gonna look into it. It's like you gonna make sure it's like safe, reliable or whatever the case is. Um, But it looks like, 
you could already know, you know, what type of vehicle you want or something. That that could be actually some homework for some people, y'all. It's like if you are wanting a new vehicle, write down what it is that you want. I remember when I was trying to like when I was manifesting a new car, um, I said that I wanted I um I what I say? I had did a video on this like um like a while ago. But basically I made sure I said that it's safe, reliable, like, you know, transportation or whatever. And then I said what type of color I wanted. Cause I ain't know exactly what type of car I wanted. I just know that I wanted it to be black or whatever. Oh, you know, that case. But yeah, that's what's showing up. So let's see. What else are they needing to hear right now? Tell me more about journey. What does Journey have to do with the collective? Why did Journey show up as their current energy? Thank you. So we got the Five of Cups coming out. It says, spilled tea is in the end of the world. So there could be something that it is that you're disappointed about, y'all. But I feel like the pieces are, it's like the things that you're disappointed about, the pieces are, are going to be put back together. But also, it's something that it is that you're concerned about, right? Whatever that is, it's going to work itself out. I don't know exactly how, but that's what it looks like. Um, the King of Swords is showing up here at the bottom. It says we can all learn important things from one another. Um, something in regards to like receiving some type of information or communication could be significant too. But low key, this King of Swords is kind of giving like somebody um, that works at like a car dealership or something of that sort. Because I feel like this King of Swords is involved with possibly somebody getting a new car or some type of like somebody that can help you um make the right pick or option it's like somebody that you go to could be like a mentor as well but it's like they're going to help you through the process that's what it looks like because even though this figure is using like a typewriter y'all i'm seeing more so like a computer like somebody um working at a computer okay tell me about this community why did community show up for the collective as their current energy why did community show up as uh, for the collective for the current energy? So, wow, five of wands. So, yeah, this is definitely on point. Because when I was mentioning, I said something feels off about a community or like a group of people. Now, it could be in regards to like possibly um, different beliefs. So, it could be in regards to spirituality or just like just things in general. I don't know. But you know how like a group of people... Um, Everybody could have their own opinion about a situation, right? But this five of wands just clarified the community card. It says a good coven lets every witch have a say. But in this situation, people are disagreeing um, with a person or a situation. This could be behind closed doors too. But I do feel like light is going to be shed. Ooh, if you in a type of situation that you could you could be concerned about, like let's just say you do got people coming up against you, right? Um, because the previous reading that I did, the one right before this one, it looked like a group of people was pointing fingers at a person. But it's like they're in the wrong about the situation because they don't have any type of like valid points. So justice is gonna be served surrounding that situation. But I do feel like what what is being said behind closed doors is going to be revealed because there's something going on back here about this door it looked like a um like an animal but you can see light being shed through this door and it looks like they're in a closet about it so even like people having conversations about you um behind your back to where it's like they just you know talking about a situation or whatever i don't know what the case is but something looks off with a community and they could be showing up like when they show up um, in your face, they could be smiling, like it's all smiles or whatever, but behind closed doors, it's not. It's like basically smoke, okay? That's what it looked like. I can't even make this up. So yeah. They could be like, oh, why should, why are they doing this? And uh, that's what it seemed like. It's like they're, uh, they're disagreeing with what you got going on behind closed doors. But anyway, let's see. Tell me about community here. And they could be shown, they could be acting as if they are supportive, but they're not. What else is um tell me more about this community for the collective? Why did community show up for their overall energy? So look, we got potion coming out, and it says, um, this is the ace of cups, and it says, Do you feel that in your heart that's potential? 
listen, for some people, you got a lot of people hating on you because they see your potential. That's what's showing up. And I'm going to show y'all the card that's at the bottom of the deck. It's like you got the, the I'm going to just say, <laughs> For a lot of people, like, and this was showing up in the uh, reading that I did yesterday. It's like, you got the juice, okay? It's something about your vibe, your energy. And you could be somebody with a really great heart, too. It's like, you got a, you, you're you just a good-hearted type of person, right? But um, when it comes towards your potential, even, like, um, this could even, too, be, like, self-love. Like, it just looked like you be loving on yourself, okay? But it's like, your cup is over overfilling i mean your cup is full with this ace of cups energy showing up but look we got this nine of wands coming out at the bottom and it says it will take um basically it says it will take a lot more to defeat you so yeah it's like the people in your um for some people there's certain people in your energy and it's a group y'all and i feel like it's more than two but the number three could be significant it could be like literally three people for somebody it's like they're trying to defeat you. It's like they could be, um, ooh, and I'm going to post a prayer. And I think I had posted it before. And I think it's like Psalms 23. But basically, be talking about the secret counsel of the wicked. Like people who like to plot against you behind closed doors. It's like basically they're, they're trying to defeat you. But it's only because like they see your potential. It's like you have a lot of potential. This could be in your career or work field or just like just people being messy. That's what it looks like. So let's see what else comes out. 10, 10 could be significant. I think I mentioned that before. Tell me about journey for the collective, please. Tell me about journey here for the collective. Wow. It says, um, this is the 10 of swords coming out. Excuse me, y'all. <laughs> Sometimes I be getting excited with the cards that's coming out because it's just like, it's confirming um, some things. Okay. But look, it says hurt people, hurt people and hurt witches, hurt witches. So for some people, I feel like people could definitely be like cursing your name. And when it comes towards like spell work too, that's what I was talking about with, well, um, it looked like people are behind closed doors, um, basically plotting against another person, right? It's like you got to understand when people are speaking ill about you and they could be saying it in a jokingly type of way, but I I be taking them joke serious. Like, no, nah, it's some truth behind that joke. Okay. But some people like to disguise it as a joke and I don't see nothing funny about it. But um, basically it's like cursing your name, like talking down on you. That's a form of spell word too. But some people are just not aware of that. But um, just to know that it's like the people trying to hurt you, they're hurt themselves. So it's like, try not to reciprocate that energy. It's like, let the energy play out. Let spirit um, or let the divine um, work things out for you. But just know that if you're in, if you're moving righteous, know that things are going to go right for you. Things will always go in your favor. I'll be having to remind myself about this too. But it's like the people who want to hex people and curse them, they're hurt themselves. And it's only because they see your potential. But anyway, let's see what else comes out. I'm going to do one more, y'all. But my um, look, my iPad done died. Phone going dead, too. I forgot to bring my charger. Um, What else are they needing to know right now? What else does the collective need to hear right now? Something about like interviews could be significant too. And for some reason, cause I, um, the, the, the queen of swords was trying to pop out, but the picture looked like, for some reason I started getting like TV show. It's giving like Oprah vibes of like, you know, somebody who's where it's like a couch involved and they got a person sitting next to them. They talking or they're asking, they're like, they're being interviewed or whatever. Something about that could be significant. Even like podcasts could be significant too. Like for some people, you could be telling your story. Because I feel like somebody has a story to tell. That could be like someone, like you're, you could be uh, speaking about your testimony, like on a public platform. But I do feel like it has like another person involved too. Something about that could be significant. But you know how like people do have platforms where it's like a safe place. 
where somebody can like speak their truth or like you know um tell their testimony that's what it looks like too so something about that could be significant that's what i'd be wanting to I, I want like a safe um space for people to like you know speak their truth or say what's on their mind or whatever you can share certain things too what else are they need to hear right now and sometimes, you know, people find their safe place like online or, you know, you can if, you may find your safe place on somebody's platform too. But um, we got the Ace of Pentacles coming out and it says, wow, what an abundant opportunity. So it looks like you're being blessed with a new opportunity, y'all. Abundance is in the air. Um, we got the Hermit card showing up here too. And it says, there are some things that must be done on your own. So um, this is the Hermit and it says, solitary... Yeah, solitary witch. And you could be the type of person who just keeps to yourself. But it definitely shows where, yeah, somebody like some people um got some some stuff going on, some messy stuff. They messing with a person who'd really just be like chilling, keeping to theirself. It's like, you know, you could be um reading a lot of books. You may not even spend too much time on social media too, because the person's phone, the figure's phone is sitting here on the books. And you could just be like, you know, um, gaining new knowledge, learning new things or whatever. Like you really just be minding your business. You be out of the way. But um, that's what it's looking like. So I'm actually in the rate here, y'all. But thank you very, very much for watching.